wasn't fully able to illustrate, but we get the idea. Rick, like you see the amount that Guy Guy had to worry about while Fawn could slowly chip, chip, chip away, but she's not gonna continue the duck hunt. Uh, no, not when Wario is just I can't a good think combo of a character. D word here. that goes a, a D word. Yeah, a D. Uh, uh, a D they, they, they did it. <laughs> they're gonna yes. go into the next game. They're, yeah, they're going the <laughs> Wario here up against this cloud, trying to find a different answer in their massively deep pockets. And Wario is certainly a good one if you can find the right hit. Yeah, and these, oh, these out of shield climb hazards, so strong. So good. A good option against a floaty character like Wario. Already at 97%. It's still pretty even, though. The big danger of Wario a lot of times is like you are very susceptible to getting out of shielded because uh, forward air and back air are often done while rising and that's just free real estate for just any good out of shield option and Cloud's got a couple of them. Oh, and good trip. Trying to go for the down tilt into maybe a dash attack Ooh. and an excellent punish. No kill throw just yet though. On oh, that back air. Still has bike, doesn't even need it. Uh, well, you know, that bike is gone. Hopefully they had insurance on that. Yeah. Cloud prefers his own motorcycle. It, it is a little cooler, yeah. but it doesn't have the great paint job. <laughs> it's just true. all black like his wardrobe. What, hey, a, what a New Yorker. He's just an edgy anime boy. Oh. You said, well, no. you know. <laughs> That's usually so, so good, but being sent the wrong way, some uh, over uh, overcompensation on the drift there from Fawn. Oh, should have held shield, maybe shifted it a bit. Finishing touch to close out the second stock. Who gets that in brackets? What a setup. Gotta love it, right? Like the, A, finishing touch is just the perfect punish, but also finding yourself in an unexpected tech situation can often mean you're scrambling just in a brief moment. All right, in a brief moment here, that Fawn is an advantage, pushing Carful to the ledge. Dash attack, not yeah. killing. Trying to follow in the uh -oh. air. No bike. But did have the jump and able to get back to the ledge just in time. It's, I mean, 169, you're thinking, like, I need just about anything, and that up smash is certainly not going to be there for Fawn as she is behind this eight ball. All right? Trying to get maybe a back air, maybe a down tilt into something, anything. They want to keep that waft at least until the next stock to bring, make this even. This okay. is the majesty of Cloud Strike. Like, 198. It's hard. Like characters with a with this good a neutral, where you gain something when just you gain something at almost every game state. Mm -hmm. Like it just becomes so hard to try and execute a win condition. BD Bean reference. The if you side B while bike is on stage, mm -hmm. Wario will look for the bike. Oh no! <laughs> oh oh what? No punish? It is very low end lag, uh -huh. and you can B-reverse it to change Wario's momentum with basically no risk at all. That's a good idea. It's really cheeky. Is it oh. good? Uh, I think it's cool. It's pretty good. But then that last stock was really good <laughs> as well. a big sword, so it gets really <laughs> hard to like try and mix up your movement and like play the air game when Cloud's already frame trapping you. Yes. Already, like, once you're in the air, disadvantage. Yeah. And poor Fawn just Stop. couldn't find an in. That back air coverage, these limits, and, man, That's pulling tough. out that motorcycle. It was a good idea to try and, like, mix up, like, your getup, but, you know, when you can just throw out a back air and cover the edge. Yeah. Like, it's, yeah. th it's this type of situation that I'm, like, the... Kazuya. Kazuya. It was, oh. some, it was something like an up tilt or a forward tilt that set Fawn up into an, uh, a platform on a platform when she wasn't ready to tech. And that means you're just, you're basically auto reading, oh, she was DIing in, so I'm just going to read tech roll in. But yeah. either way, this, the pivot comes out, Kazuya comes in. Let's now, I know the tag says all jokes, but this Kazuya is no joke. Kazuya is pretty broken. Like the right hands. Oh. Okay, it's fine. Well, good boots. Only taking 60% of the first 30 seconds of the match. Yeah. Oh, and you're okay. And that was an immediate swing back, being like, ah, we're going to second stock. Okay. Carflow, what Carflow does best is play fast. What this cloud needed to learn was how do I play fast as I do with Roy? But because yes. he's steadily starting to figure out like just what he needs to be doing without thinking about it, like what he should be doing. Mm -hmm. Now it's becoming that much more dangerous. You're seeing the flow start to take hold. 
and a cloud with a great un uh, innate understanding is something to be feared. Yes, the Bond just looking for some good confirms into maybe an up special, a smash attack, anything, and a good up smash to take that second stock. Feels like every time Carflow gets off that Angel platform, it's almost like a stock for Fawn. Okay, here we go. Rage Art online. How's Carflow gonna edge guard here? You get one shot at this. Um, the Rage Drive before it probably ends up going away, and you land it. That might be it. Not quite. No. Laser. Laser again. Uh, Fawn respected the limit. Luckily, coming back online just in time for Carflow. Just a little bit of a stall there from Fawn. And finally a back air. This is an even game. Carflow just needs to space this out. Fawn just needs to put them in the mix. One up smash. Danger. Do it. <laughs> electric fists. It's the danger mode. Oh. We're at electric up smash percents for sure. But if Fawn wants to be safe, she can do uh, electric and demon wings. And that's just play Tekken. Yeah, we're, we're just playing a Tekken, but... If you're spending oh, so no much way. time pressing Good one coverage. button, you're that might fun. be it. No, yeah, no not, rage. Not the empowered up version. Oh my That's lord! Fawn being like, yeah, that cut my cause was good. Cause this is so Yoshima. ambiguous too. Mm. Let's check that out. Yeah, what happened? <laughs> I like the little thumbs up being like, yeah, good switch. Okay, it's not okay. As, it's not as actually as ambiguous as I thought, but yeah, like you get the spacing here. Mm -hmm. And oh. you force this air dodge. Mm -hmm. Like this forward air, the searing edge, as yeah. it's called, which is excellent. Love that name. This forward air is all intended to do exactly one thing. Mm -hmm. Force the defense out of car flow. If you see the forward air, you can land on the platform and do run off Nair if it's just a neutral air dodge. But this air dodge in, the quickest of reactions, mind you, to go into while rising the, what is it? The... Demon God Fist, I believe it's called. Oh, look, Tekken has like 120 moves per character. Yeah, it's, it's okay to forget some. <laughs> I'm trying, okay? <laughs> Either way, the wall rising, setting up perfectly for the finish, and it is truly a no-win scenario for a character that can put you in a lot of no-win scenarios. Ah, this is a difficult counter pick, but I think it's a good one. Cloud is going to have a lot more space to get those projectiles to space out, but oh, yeah. this is a much longer stage as well, setting up for some infinite combos. Not that Fawn knows any, but you can still at least like jab to the ledge. I mean, sometimes you don't need to know the insane stuff, like some of the battlefield setups with uh, IDJ up air. Sometimes you just need to know uh, electric spiking there, demon god fist up, uh, dragon uppercut, or Ooh. electric into back air for all of that damage. Now we are for certain into the uh, an up e kill percents. Something that Fawn loves to do that I don't think a lot of other Kazuyas do is use like those other moves. Like, oh, what is it, 11 different kinds of jabs? Yeah, it's really nice. Uh, Kazuya has uh, one tilt for uh, eight directions, plus like a gentleman, plus the 10 hit combo, plus wall rising, plus a, a command, two command throws. Lots of cool stuff, all of which includes some amount of invulnerability, like that frame seven flash tornado that takes the first stock off the car flow. Okay, they're gonna get back. No two frame there. All jokes, all smiles from Fawn as they try and make it back. They're just broken. Yeah. And they are fully aware of about what they're abusing because haha, take 30, just like that. No rage arc, but manages to get that damage in. Off stage. Oh, nice phantom foot stool. Yeah, Carflow's hunting for this back here. That was an up smash. You got the cross up. That's always the danger of cloud didn't back here. You right. gotta believe again. You're trying to set up so much conditioning with Cloud back air on block, and that the mix-up comes oftentimes from raw spacing, whether or not you're full range or you're going for an inside cross-up. Carflow trying to play into that, okay. just getting the climb hazard out of shield though, keeping it safe. Wow. Yeah, that down air covers so much. bond has been trying to do like uh, some two frames or learn how to do that, but this could actually be pretty good with Cloud if they miss the ledge. It doesn't auto snap like other characters. Okay, sure. we're see here. We're seeing some higher and higher defensive play come out from Carflow, but misreading the DI initially, but still having a follow up the up Whoa. air to stop the in the attempted edge guard. But they make it back. This is it. That jab does kill a ledge. Vaughn so ahead right now, 62%. As long as they can keep Carflow from spacing them out, they got this.
Sorry, back air did 20. <laughs> <laughs> yep, Cloud. Cloud is also broken, they say. No, 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 uh, Kazuya back air. <laughs> oh, Kazuya back air, my apologies. Yeah, he got hit by one move, Ooh. and it's been a back air. Never mind, Carflow is back in it. We got a game, folks. Yeah. I want to see Carflow try and extend some of these advantage states. Like, make them vertical, not horizontal. It forces a much more linear uh, type of disadvantage from Kazuya, as opposed to his ability to get back to ledge, which honestly isn't all that bad in comparison to juggling him, which is what you're getting way more bang for your buck. All right, Fawn trying to get in, trying to get one confirmed, Safe. but nice little jab there on platform. What do we see here? No finishing touch, but maybe just throwing out the projectile. Wow, this That's limit. caught Fawn every single time. Yeah, this limit Blade Beam, I was just thinking it's where it's like, it has gotten so much value. Whenever Fawn gets tired of just waiting and goes in, Carful will just throw it out. Oh, but the fair to catch the jump. <gasps> Dragon okay. Uppercut does hit below ledge if you space it right. So Good Lord. Fawn was hunting for exactly that. The auto oh. turnaround. Nice little jab into a grab. The laser hitting its mark. Do it again. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is bad. We're chasing so far the Demon Scissors, but it doesn't hit in. Uh, doesn't hit behind. Good roll behind from Carflow. Limit online. We're gonna see another one. The limit cross slash has to be coming soon. Yeah. Are going you going low. out? No, no, no. He's not Swiss. Yes, he is. Yes. Oh no! They went too low. They had the right idea to try and avoid it, but you know, eventually you're gonna hit that blast zone. That oh, was so close. So tense. I love it though. I love every bit. And we're, I'm not, how far? How low did they go? I want to see that. I'm gonna, I just want to show this off real quick. Yeah, of course. This is so silly. Oh yeah. The okay. In, the invulnerability, right? Oh <gasps> yeah, <laughs> that's what we're doing. <laughs> that hair is not a hurt box. Just, just, just a little, just a little off the top, please, Barber. <laughs> oh my God, it's aerodynamic. Yeah. He's, <laughs> he's got the flow going. But this, yeah. How this was low great. did they go? This was great. Okay. Right, we're going to see the Glimmer Cross Slash and then, yeah. Oh. But right at the beginning. Yeah. What did Carflow do? Oh, Iron. they're just getting started. We got 